When you give a kid a jersey with their name on it, they feel part of something. I think it's very important that those kids are recognized and are really a part of an athletic department. My name is Kurt Melcher. I'm the executive director of eSports at Robert Morris University. In 2014, we were the first school to really formalize eSports and offer scholarships for talented players and operate it similarly as we do any athletic program that we have. Oh, I got him, Nash. We did get some pushback, though, on the traditional athletic side where People were saying, this is a waste of time. How could you call this athletics? Let's go. I think there's still a stereotype that goes along with video games and in esports in particular. People just sort of assume it's eating Cheetos, Mountain Dew in the basement, 2 a.m., lazy. And that's a kill. Esports and what we do here is a lot different than that. They practice. Even though it's low, they communicate as a team. Welcome to the North American Collegiate Championships. We have it's five on five, playing mid-match, usually a set of three. Robert Morris University will not be stopped. I think that was the right play. In between games, we'll have a coach just like traditional athletics, where the coach comes in, talks to the players what to do before the game, after the games, in between games, trying to get them that right mentality. I don't know, would you say? The tenants of athletics are in esports. Those life lessons of winning, losing, learning how to operate within a team, take directions from the coaching staff. Good job, guys. Good job. Good job. All of those lessons can also be delivered through esports. I think that corporations are just now starting to identify esports as an important industry for them. 70% of collegiate esports student athletes uh, identify as STEM, so science, technology, engineering, and math, and that's a valuable demographic that I feel marketers have a hard time reaching. I think esports are a perfect vehicle, especially on the collegiate side, to deliver that student or that demographic. We've got Robert Morris University taking on. There's a whole industry that's just booming and growing at an exponential rate. That was an incredibly intense game.